So what is worst case scenario? Like how could AI eventually lead to the destruction of the human race? So you can ask me how I would kill everyone. Sure. And it's a great question. I can give you standard answers. I would talk about computer viruses breaking into maybe nuclear facilities, nuclear war. I can talk about synthetic biology, nanotech. But all of it is not interesting Then you realize we're talking about super intelligence, a system which is thousands of times smarter than me. It would come up with something completely novel, more optimal, better way, more efficient way of doing it. And I cannot predict it because I'm not that smart. Jesus. And it could be very similar. I, again, I cannot predict what it can do, but if it needs to turn the planet into fuel, raise temperature of a planet, cool it down for servers, whatever it needs to do, it wouldn't be concerned about your well-being. It wouldn't be concerned about any life, right? Because it doesn't need biological life in order to function, as long as it has access to power. Recursive self-improvement is where the computer is off learning, and you don't know what it's learning. That can obviously lead to bad outcomes. Another one would be direct access to weapons. Another one would be that the computer systems decide to exfiltrate themselves, to reproduce themselves, without our permission. The AI, like, develops some sense of agency and does not want to be stopped. And, you know, even even if it's just like trying to accomplish a goal and there's no intentionality or consciousness, but it's like, I need to not be stopped by these humans in pursuit of this goal. Once we have super intelligence, the question is, will it take over? We should work very hard to make it not happen. And we should be doing research now on how you would prevent them taking over. And my belief is we have to prevent them from wanting to take over. The one thing I regret is I didn't get concerned with safety sooner.